unboxing, <gasps> unboxing. Hey flockers, it's Emily and Bogey, and today we're gonna be talking about toys and why toys are important, what kind of toys are we looking for, and we get to do an unboxing today of our favorite, favorite toys. We're gonna see what's in store for us. Oh. Always cut away from you, Bogey. Let's take a look. First toy we got is a new type of bird kebab that I actually have never seen before. Wow, this thing is so cool. Bogey's already so excited. You wanna chew it? This one's super cool. I got the forging kit because I can hide a little safflower seeds and treats in the toys. So when I leave for work or I have a really busy day, Bogey's in his cage with fun stuff to do. And trust me, he's always busy. Now this is sweet. This is so cool. Yeah. Look at that, bud. This is great for hiding treats. See all those little holes, nooks, and crannies? Do you even want to hang out in me right now? Look at this. There, proof. Proof that your bird will love these toys. So different box, different day. I just wanted to show you guys the variety of toys that we get. This is a custom box I got. Medium and small toys. So this is just like a giant natural net with really cool shreddy uh, looks like palm fronds in it. It's very, very neat. Bogey's already into it. Just more shreddy stuff. And the cool thing is that you could put treats and pellets even within these toys and it really gets your bird mentally stimulated, physically stimulated. It's really good during this time, especially Bogey's been Having to have a lot more cage time lately because he has been a lot more aggressive since it's spring. So I want to make sure that when he is in his enclosure, he has plenty of really fun stuff to play with. And this is really cool because it has cuddle bone on it, which gives them a little bit more calcium. Yeah, Bogey is all over these already. That's really cool. Look at this. It's Lee. This is kind of similar to the other one. It looks like a caged in hay barrel almost, if that makes sense. What I really like about these toys is that they have oyster shell on them as well. And not only does that help their beak, it gives them calcium. So it's really cool. This one is kind of like a little jellyfish, which I like. This is what your bird should be doing to its his or her toys. This is the sign of a healthy bird. See this? Destroyed. And I loved this because I put a bunch of seeds and treats in here when I would be gone. And uh, he just tore it up. I know that Bogey and I have been struggling lately with springtime and these toys have been amazing for when Bogey goes back into his cage. Your guys' bird seems bored or not as excited to go into his or her enclosure. Maybe think about a new line of toys. And remember you guys, no matter what toys you decide to buy, please steer clear of plastics and nylons and really cheap metals because that could severely, severely injure or even kill your bird. Buy natural, right Bogue? Buy natural, yeah he agrees. Say goodbye. Can you wave? <laughs>